Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. We are so happy to be down here at the shelter showing off these wonderful animals, but so sad that there are animals to show off at the shelter. So we need to get them home for the holiday. Especially at this time of year or any time of year, we don't like to see animals here because we are closed for so many days and they have to be here by, be at the shelter by themselves for a long time. We don't like that at all, do we, Deborah? No, we don't like that at all. And neither does Bambi right there on your lap. She doesn't like that at all either. No, and look, you could have an adorable Christmas card with a dog like Bambi, right? Yes. You put on your Santa hat, you hold your dog, and life is good. You do something like that, and you get a great shot, and you have your, your Christmas card and your Christmas fun. So come on and get a dog or get a cat. You'll, you'll, you'll have a happier holiday if you do that. This little tiny girl is just about seven years old, so she's that terrific middle age where she's well behaved but still has years and years and years of fun left in her. And we think you should come meet her. Bambi's ID number is 221 936. Oh my god. That is Deborah. like the cutest dog I've ever seen in my life. If, if, if I thought my husband would not leave me immediately if I brought home another one, I'd be taking this dog home. Look at her, Terry. So she's available. Oh my gosh, she is somebody so else. cute. She was, let me see, brought in on the 7th of December, picked up, well, somewhere, I can't find it on here. Found, oh, found in Paso Robles. And look at that tongue. Oh my God, somebody has got, oh Lord. I can't believe nobody's looking for this dog. I want this dog. <laughs> look but at you're her. not having it, so somebody oh, else can somebody have this dog. somebody else can have her, but that's not fair. Um, we're gonna call her Polly. If her owners don't come looking for her, and I cannot believe they're not looking for her, but if they don't come looking for her, we're naming her Polly, and she's waiting down here, and she won't be here long. She's just too dang cute. Polly's ID number is 222 my gosh, what a Christmas present that would be. Cutest ever, ever. This is a beautiful little dog and he is just a baby. Hooney is only nine months old. Uh, the landlords would not allow his owners to keep him. He's a beautiful little dog. Very smart, no sit, um, just a gorgeous shiny black coat, couldn't be any better. Um, so if you're looking for a, a pup, come down and check out Hooney. Uh, interesting name. ID number 222-087. Well, this little guy's about as cute as he could be. Some sort of uh, Russell, Russell Parsons Terrier, Jack Russell Terrier kind of dude going on there. He's really cute. He's not at all interested in being on television or on camera. Uh, about seven years old and cute as can be. ID number 222121. We're going to name him Jackson. Now there's a handsome dude. Take a look at that face. He's just all, you know, he's got his beads. He's got his little jolly face. You just want to squeeze it, kiss that little, that quick kiss that mug. Um, this is a seven year, approximate seven year old. Um, his name is Bowie and he just wants to be your best friend. He's very loving and very sweet and we just really think he's gorgeous. Bowie's ID number is 221991. Not every dog could rock that scarf he has on. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. He looks great. I am telling you, there are some good looking dogs down here. Here's another one that's after my own heart. He seems really nice with people and really very uh, nice with other dogs. He's just a big old beefcake. Um, so if you need a little beefcake in your life, and really folks, think about it. Who doesn't? Really? I think you do. Um, this little guy has, or this little, this little guy has been with us since the 5th of December, picked up in a Pomo and nobody's come looking for him. And I can't even believe that, but he is a nice guy. We're going to call him Mason. If nobody comes looking for him and his ID number is 222-036. Super sweet tub of goo right there.
So who doesn't want a great looking lab that likes to play frisbee, likes to swim, loves the water, good ball dog. Come on, that is your quintessential Labrador right there. And we'll keep his reindeer ears on. Been here since the, I know, and that is pretty amazing. He's that been here amazing. since the 7th of December. Somebody should be looking for this sweet guy found in Pismo Beach. So far they have not come looking for him. So he is up for adoption at this point. And uh, we're gonna call him, well, I'm not sure we're gonna call him because he hasn't been here very long, but that is a great looking dog. ID number 222082. Tommy is actually, he's one of my favorites. He's a little crazy. Um, we're teaching him some manners <laughs> since he got here. He's a little bit of a wild child, but he's a really nice guy, curious about everything. Our Wants trainer to know what's said going he's on. the most improved dog that she's ever I worked know. with. He's, he's quickly just, learning. He is. He's got beautiful eyes. He's got these big old green eyes. Look at that. He's a great dog. He, he, needs, he needs continued training and exercise in his new home, but he's going to be someone's best friend. And Deborah, half his adoption fee is paid. That's right. So that saves you more than $50 if you come down here to adopt this guy. Tommy's ID number is 221-224. Now, does that not look like a dog that you can go out and have some fun with? Look at that. We love this girl. She came, this is Bluebell. She came into the shelter, kind of a wild child, and um, she's been getting a lot of work with our trainer, and her manners have gotten a lot better. She definitely needs to be in an active home. She needs her exercise, but she's very affectionate, very sweet, and a lot of fun. And half her adoption fee has been paid. Yes, it has. Mm -hmm. So we're very motivated to help this girl get into a home. She's a great size, too. Bluebell's ID number is 220-927. She is a shelter favorite. It's got great ears, too, if you didn't notice. This is Clyde. He's a nice guy. Eight years old, his folks could no longer keep him. Um, so he's kind of sad to be down here, but he's a very nice dog. He knows sit, shake. He waits at the door if he's asked before he goes out. House trained, good on leash, and all around sweet, somewhat senior dog. Not too senior, but somewhat senior, and des deserves to get a nice home for the rest of his life. So he qualifies for the senior rebate, $35 back, Deborah. Yes, so he's also a bargain dog, mm -hmm, and that, that mm -hmm. helps. Every little bit helps. His ID number is 199014. This is Clyde. This beautiful girl is named Liza. She's a nice dog. She's house trained. She loves people. You can see she's a leaner. She would just like to hang out with you on the couch and watch movies and go for a walk occasionally. She also likes to play fetch. Liza's ID number is 221-472. Oh, she's sweet. This is a very cute new arrival to the shelter. He just got here today, the 11th of December. He was picked up on high at High and Broad in San Luis Obispo. Somebody should be looking for this cutie pie. If they don't come and find him though, he's gonna be up for adoption and he'll go fast. He's adorable and he's a great size. This is Harvey and his ID number is 927-752. Aw, this pretty girl, darn it. She, they, she and her brother or partner or whatever could, could no longer be kept by their owner. So we have them down here. Sweet dogs. Um, this is Sadie. She's about five years old and she just needs a new home to, to be happy. And she's so cute. Her ID number is 221-517. This is Sadie. Sweet Sadie. <laughs> oh, a kisser too. Oh, yeah. This very beautiful dog is one of the best dogs in the entire shelter. Just a really good personality, really good with other dogs. She can be kind of a rowdy player, but she loves to play with other dogs. Um, she's sweet. She knows sit. She knows shake. She's soft and squishy. We really, really like Hazel. Her ID number is 221-934, and this is a very, very good dog. Oh, this is just a sweet older girl who th through no fault of her own has lost her home and she is so confused as to why she's down here. She's probably nine or 10 years old and so she does have the senior rebate with her adoption so you get $35 back if you adopt this dog. 
She's a doll. She just needs a retirement home for a few years. An absolute precious sweet girl. Her ID number is 222123. This is the very sweet Bailey. This is a handsome dog. This is Kenny. Um, his owners could no longer keep him. He's older too. He's about nine years old. So he gets a rebate if he gets adopted as well. Kenny's ID number is A beautiful dog, um, Husky or Malamute. He's just about three years old. He was found in Paso Robles um, on the 6th of December and nobody's come looking for him, which surprises me a little bit. He's, a, he's playing right now. He's very beautiful. His ID number is 222067. Beautiful Husky. Larry had the nerve to say this dog is arrogant. I do not think so. This is little Duke and he's scared down here. He's not terribly familiar with the leash, so he does not enjoy you putting the leash on him. But as soon as he's comfortable with you, he is in your lap. He's kissing your face. He's snuggling in. He's as precious as he can be. And he is soft as a bunny. That doesn't it's, sound like arrogant. To it me. is. He is not arrogant at all. It might be a case of the, ke the, the pot calling the kettle black, but I wouldn't say oh. that. So Little Sweet Duke's ID number is 222094, and he is just a darling little guy. A little proud, maybe, but not arrogant. <laughs> Got a four-year-old Bichon Frise mix here. That is a cute little dog. He was found on... Oh, he's been here since November 28th. My goodness, I can't believe nobody's come to get him. Anyway, this is a gorgeous little four-year-old boy, and you should probably come adopt him because he's cute. His ID number is 947734. So here I am out with one of my good friends. This is where we go walking our dogs. We get to sit on some park benches now and again. It was a great opportunity for you guys to come out. We need volunteers. We'd really like some more dog walkers. We're at a point now where we just don't have enough people walking the dogs and these dogs have to stay in their kennel day in and day out, 24 by seven. These dogs really need to get out, have a little exercise, feel the grass. You can sit with them out here, socialize them. It makes them ever so much more adoptable. So if you've got any time whatsoever, we could use you down here. Bring a friend. Two of you walk dogs together. We have dogs that get along with other dogs that you can go out with together. It's a fabulous opportunity for both you and the dog. We'd love to see you down here. It's easy to be a volunteer. We're a great bunch of people. I guarantee it. You can have a lot of fun and help the dogs. Think about it. God. <laughs> this guy came in from Paso Robles on the 12th of December, and no one's come looking for him. He's very affectionate, loves people a lot. Okay with some other dogs, not so crazy about others. Great looking dog, and if no one comes looking for him, we're going to name him Dirk, because he just looks like a Dirk. His ID number is 220083, just about two years old. This is a young guy. This guy is really smart and he's very active. So he needs an active home. He should be someone's running partner, jogging partner, hiking partner, something. He's, he's good with other dogs. He's kind of rowdy so we can irritate him if they're real super low key, but he's a nice dog. Just about a year old, smart as he can be, picks up commands really fast and his favorite thing in the whole world is playing with the tug rope. He and I have had some great times playing with the tug rope. So I really, really like this guy. 
Jet's ID number is 219130. I'm surprised he's not adopted yet because he is just a great dog. <laughs> well, we pretty much always have a Husky or Malamute uh, around these days. This is a gorgeous dog. We're going to call him Sherlock. He came from um, Arroyo Grande on the 4th of December. He's a beautiful creature, kind of independent as the breed tends to be. Um, but a, just a really beautiful representative of the breed. His ID number is 222020. This is to be named Sherlock. Oh, this is, this is Rosie. She's a beautiful young hound dog. She's just about two years old. Um, very nice dog. She's got a lot of energy. You know, so she needs to be in an active home. She needs to get her, her training in, but a very beautiful and nice dog. Her ID number is 221-277. This is Rosie. <laughs> this is a big boy named Diesel. He's an American Bulldog, um, just about a year old. So he's a very young dog and um, he needs a home. His ID number is 217-699. This is Diesel. Hey, Nacho, check out my new jewelry. Where'd you get that? My person decided to put this cool tag on me. Now if I ever get lost, other people can help me get home. Gee, I better get one, too. Be responsible. Join the pack today and show your four-legged friend just how much you love them. Hey, mister, don't call the pound. I live just around the corner. Oh, man, this doesn't look good for me. If only I had some kind of ID. Uh-oh, Nacho is headed for the pound. With a visible ID, he'd be headed home. Let's all join the pack of responsible pet owners. If you love them, tag them. Wait, what's that? Oh no, it's Nacho. I told him to get a pet ID tag. I hope he's okay. Our pets depend on us for their safety. Join the pack of responsible pet owners. If you love them, tag them. Nacho, you're okay. Whoa, that was a close call. I could have lost my life at the pound. Well, now you have a tag. Not only a tag, but a microchip, too. Can't take any chances. No one expects their pets to get out, but they do. An ID is a lifesaver. If you love them, tag them. Next up, we've got Jesse. His markings are so nice. He's a very light gray tabby. You don't see many... Tabby's marked like this, light gray, and a little bit of a Bengal marking on him. He's just eight months old, and that means he's just out of kittenhood. Half of his adoption fee is paid. That is great for you. And his ID number is 221074. Jesse. Gosh golly gee, this is one of the prettiest cats I have ever seen. This cat's name is Bengal, and his markings are beautiful. He's got the classic tabby of the tabby side, and he's a tabby on white with gorgeous eyes. Look at him. Oh my goodness. And guess what? Half of his adoption fee has been paid. Yes, he is our volunteer pick of December. Bengal's number is 221414, and if you fall in love with him, Half adoption fee already paid for you, and you get this gorgeous, gorgeous cat. 221414 Bengal. Okay, we've got Lively Duncan here, or Duncan Lively as we like to call him. He is fantastic, playing, playing, playing. He just had a piece of newspaper that he attacked and rolled around in. So much fun is Duncan. He is a kitten. ID number 221954 Duncan. And here is Abigail, and she has those beautiful Bengal markings also. She is just about six months old, and her ID number is 221075, and she has half of her adoption fee paid. This is so fantastic. So you need to come down here and meet some of these cats, especially the ones who have half adoption fee paid. My goodness. Abigail, ID number 221075. Here we've got Tawny, and look at her markings. How fabulous is that? She's got some calico coloring, and yet she's got the tabby markings and a little splash of tortoiseshell. She's all mixed up. She is an older gal. She is a senior, so we offer a senior special of $35 back to you if you adopt Tawny. 
Her ID number 221783, and she is really a big favorite of the volunteers. Tawny, 221783. Here is a big, handsome, beautiful black boy. His name is Bert, and he is a senior, which means he qualifies for the senior rebate. That is $35 back to you if you adopt Bert. His ID number, 222018, Bert. Oh, no. Bonsai Cat is attacking the village. Mighty Bonsai Cat is stalking before the final kill. We'll never get out of here alive if he sees us. We'll never escape in time. Ah! Medic! Medic! Is this the end of civilization? Mighty Bonsai Cat waits no more! Ah, with one flick of the tail, it's all over! Colonel, where's that airstrike order? That... Mm, the bombers are useless against Bonsai Cat! Think of cat. all the fun you can have with an adopted pet. Contact your local shelter or pet adoption center. Hello, Moon. Yep, that's his name, Moon. He is just about seven months old. As you can see, he's a black and white tuxedo. We haven't had a lot of them lately, so if you're a fan of the black and white tuxedo, come and check out Moon. ID number 220215, Moon. Meet Jordan. Jordan is another senior here. He is a beautiful orange and white cat, long-haired, as you can see. He qualifies for the senior rebate. That's right, $35 back to you if you fancy Jordan and adopt him. ID number 221650. Please think about giving a senior a home. 221650. Well, here's a little sweetheart. This is Jeb, and he's just about four months old. He's a kitten. His ID number is 221996. I think he is adorable and will make a great pet. 221996, Jeb. Here's a big, beautiful girl peeking out. This is Daphne, and she's about four years old. Her ID number is 222042. She is a long-haired tortoise shell. ID number 222042. Here's another orange tabby. Everybody's screaming for the orange tabbies. Well, we've got a good selection today. This is Cooper. ID number 221998. Cooper. Isn't this a pretty kitty? This is Pebbles. She is a tabby on white. She's just about six months old, and her ID number is 221325. She is so pretty. 221325. Pebbles. Well, if you like tortoise shells, these are the two for you. They are sisters. We have Rita and Flo. Flo's number 220, no, 222090, and Rita 222089. They are long-haired and tortie. Rita 222089 and Flo 222090. And they will get along together if you have a place for two cats. These are great cats to take together. <laughs> Here's another tortoise shell. This is a senior. This is Suki. She qualifies for the senior rebate, $35 back if you decide to adopt her. ID number 221961, Suki. Okay, you guys who love the gray cat, here is Elvira waiting for you. She's just about a year old. Her ID number is 221845, and she is a great, great cat. 221845 Elvira. 
Hello, Lucky. Hopefully this could be your lucky day or somebody out there is watching you and uh, it will be they're your lucky person that comes in to adopt you. Lucky needs a home as do all our cats and dogs. We'd like everybody home for the holidays. So consider Lucky or any of our other animals. Lucky's number is 221335. Hello, say hi to Oprah. Oprah is just about three years old. As you can see, she's a gorgeous black cat. She is ID number 222015. That is Oprah. Super friendly, super lovely Oprah. 222015. Say hi to Jake. He is a tabby on white, just about eight months old. ID number 222043. That's Jake. This is such a pretty cat. I love her coloring. You have to come down here and see. She almost has a lavender coloring in her fur because she's dilute and very beautifully marked. Her name is Anne, and her ID number is 222071. That's Anne, 222071. Well, we've had some inquiries about kittens. Do we still have kittens? Well, yes, we still have kittens. There used to be a kitten season, but now, due to global warming, I think, kitten season is happening all year round. There is no kitten season. We will have kittens every day of the year. So if you are still looking for kittens, we have some here. We have some in foster. So call Animal Services and find out what we have available out in fo foster. 781-4413 and come down and see some kittens here right at the shelter. They're adorable.